A figuratively and literally sweeter story of the green and gold. For the past 13 years, Nancy Bollier has been bringing homemade baked goods to Packers players at practice or before games, all because she loves the team and wants to bring them some home comfort. Now, Nancy is nominated, no surprise really, I guess, for the Packers fan Hall of Fame. Our Emily Riley got to spend some time with Nancy today. A fun assignment, I am sure. How did Nancy get connected, I guess, with the Packers? Always been a fan, but to, to be their baker, if you will. Right. It was incredible talking to this woman. She just loves the Packers. And she was telling me, you know, she's been a lifelong fan. She's from Manitowoc. And she used to go to Packers, Packers, Oh, sorry. Packers, practice. <laughs> Packers practices uh, with her friends for the past like 10 or so years. And when she was at these practices, they would notice that a lot of the rookies on the team are, are new and from, you know, just different areas where they might not have family around and they are kind of just on their own in their own apartments. Like and the first year in college or exactly, something. Exactly. That's what she compared it to. And she's like, oh, these are just young guys and maybe they need some, a little bit of home. And so that's where the tradition started. And she uh, would make these cookies for them. And it started off with just the rookies and it's expanded to every other player. Maybe you see Donald Driver <laughs> a lot. Yes. She, it sounds like, it looks like she's pretty well known. Uh, what are some of her, uh, her specialty items or favorite treats to, to you know, bake and, and take to the players well her top two are snickerdoodles and chocolate mm. chip those are the fan favorites everybody loves those um, I can attest they are incredible <laughs> I'm sure you delicious <laughs> uh, but one of her special ones she called them DD bars they were like chocolate bars double um, double D bars and she would give them to Donald Driver like the double D <laughs> so that was really fun and cute and she's just she gets creative she tells me some of the players like nuts some of them don't like nuts she rattled them off she knew which one liked which one and it was it was really impressive <laughs> it was really nice looking at all the photos you can tell she has got a relationship with quite a few of the players are there are there certain players that have uh, stood out to her and have really developed a friendship and an appreciation for what she does? Yeah, some of the names she mentioned were Aaron Jones, um, Kenny Clark, and Romeo Dobbs. They were all, um, you know, fans of hers, I guess. <laughs> they uh, love when she comes around, and like you said, she is well-known there, and they all love her cooking. And, and yeah, she's hoping it'll fuel their their win and their success <laughs> with this game tomorrow. And so. then she can be back uh, baking <laughs> again next week. <laughs> exactly. Well, a sweet assignment for you today. Yes. And, and you got some samples, <laughs> right? Oh, yeah. Oh, wow. I'll bring some. <laughs> okay, Emily, thank you very much.